There's two screws, one right here, one over here. We're gonna take those out with a Phillips head screwdriver. Now we're gonna remove this panel right here underneath. Use a seven millimeter socket. Take these screws out. There's one over here. And just grab the panel, slide it down. And then this panel needs to come out. Uh, use a seven millimeter socket. Take these screws out. This one there. One over here. Take these screws out. There may be a seven millimeter socket or maybe a Phillips head. Take those out. This one happens to be a Phillips head. Slide those out and then grab the panel and just slide it off. There's screws, take these screws out. There's two on this side, one over on the other side of the steering wheel. Use a Phillips head screwdriver, take those out. In the center here, there should be a screw. So either a Phillips head or a seven millimeter. Take that screw out. Now lower the steering wheel and just grab the trim and slide it forward. Disconnect these connectors. Just push down on the tab, slide it out. Same with this one. There's a connector for the four wheel drive. Push down on that. Slide it off. Then the connector below that for the rear wiper. Disconnect that as well. If you need to, you can push this through. It's a little bit easier. You push down on those tabs and it slides through and then you can access the connector. Pull up on that tab, disconnect the connector. And there's two connectors back here. Push down on the tabs, slide them off, just like that. And the other connector, a little bit trickier to get to, but you just push down on the tab, it slides off. Everything's disconnected. Now carefully slide it up. If you have to, you could take the transmission out of park, but it comes out pretty easily. Take the four wheel drive switch out, just push these little tabs, slide it back, it comes right out. And take the switch, slide it in place, and just lock it down. Now I take this panel, slide it in place, Don't slide it all the way in yet. We have to connect the connectors. Connect the four wheel drive, just push it down, lock it in, and connect the wiper, wiper switch. Connect the two power ports. Take these connectors, line those up. It's kind of hard to see, you just kind of got to feel how they go. Lock it down and do the same with this one. Now line the panel up and just push it in place. You can re-secure that fastener in the middle if you had that one. We didn't have that. So we'll put these screws in. And these two. Now 
we'll slide this panel in place. Put the screws in here. And the two underneath. And over here, I'll slide this panel in position and put the two screws in. Line that up and the other one right there. 